do you get this issue of notes being sustained even if you don't have a sustain pedal um, pressed or automations being set for ringing notes and I have a Max for Life device or actually I have a few Max for Life devices for you which I can which can quickly solve that for you. So hi I'm Toby from AbletonNormal.com. I develop techniques and fixes for Ableton Live um, mainly in Max for Life. Max for Life can be used if you have Max for Life which is included in Ableton Live Suite and this device I'm showing you here um, works in 10, 11 and 12 and it's part of a pack and all those devices are working in 10, 11 and 12. So let us have a quick look at the issues so we know what we're talking about here. So for example, if you have a few notes playing and you have an envelope here um, for your pedal, sustain pedal, which is the CC64. So if this is playing, we can hear. That's an, that the notes are ringing, obviously, because the sustain pedal is being pressed down or CC64 is activated here, okay? So um, what is happening, and we can hear that if we stop the transport, obviously the ringing stops, but if I now play a few notes, the last value of the sustain um, info here, which was an on value, is still being turned on. So obviously you want to get this switched off. So this works and this works for two things here. So here's the Max for Life device. So you get the same issue as well when you are stopping a clip. So just let, before I show you the fix, let me show, quickly show you the problem here. So this clip is playing and I hit stop on the clip, so Ableton Live's transport is still playing, but the clip stopped and I have the same issue here. Notes are still being sustained and because there is still a um, sustain pedal on message in the background happening here. So all you need to do is you just need to place this device of mine auto sustain off on clip stop on this uh, MIDI track here, turn it on obviously, we can see when we play a clip, it shows our sustain is on or it's being pressed and if I stop you can see sustain is being sent out, a sustain off is being sent out and the same works for clips once more. So if we play the clip, I hit stop for the clip and an automatic sustain off is being sent out here and notes are being fixed to not sustain anymore. Okay, so one more uh, quick tip. Well, if, if you're interested in the solution, just follow the links in the video description here. Um, as I said, it's part of a pack about a whole different um, or a few more fixes here for um, sustain and a few more approaches here. So for example, if you don't have a sustain pedal, but you want to apply some sustain, there is a device in there as well. Cool. So. Um, one more trick I want to show you here once we're at this um, at this topic. So there is, since Ableton 11, you got the MIDI envelope auto reset function here. And that means if you have for pitch band and for a few more expressive, standardized expressive um, CC values here where the sustain pedal is one part of that, you can turn this on and this means if you have a clip where you have SEC um, message, so for example in here we got a, a sustain pedal on and then if we create a new clip and just put in a few notes and make sure we don't have any um, info here on the MIDI control sustain pedal, so we got no nothing, no automation in this envelope here. So. Those are plain notes. Um, let's turn off the auto sustain for now, just to show you. So we have this clip with sustain pedal. And if I now change to a different clip, which has no sustain info in here, it will ask or look for if there is any automation in the sustain info. And if there is none, Ableton Live will automatically reset this if you have the MIDI envelope auto reset being turned on. So I just wanted to mention this. So you now have with my um, Max for Life device, you get all different 
options here when stopping clips, when changing clips, you can use the um, sustain off via the uh, MIDI envelope auto reset function being, being turned on. And if you are stopping the transport, the same device works here. There was an older device or there is an older device in the pack as well, which just for the stopping here. So if you have rigging notes on any track for live stuff, and if you don't want to mess around with the clip stuff here, you can just use this one as well. The one I just mentioned, um, fix auto sustain, fix, <laughs> fix sustain off it's called. So um, yeah, as I said, a few more devices here. So if you have any issues with uh, sustain, have a look, um, check out this pack where you will find more info about the different functionalities of the different devices. Take care. Bye-bye.